Welcome back to John and Kate, Twisted Fate. Early this year, John Gosselin's wife, Kate, was constantly on the road. John had a lot of help taking care of the kids at home, and soon he found himself with a lot of time on his hands. John was spotted at local nightclubs where he got friendly with 23-year-old teacher Deanna Hummel. According to Deanna's brother, she brought the local celebrity back to their Pennsylvania home. My sister says to me, oh, John's going to get you tickets to the Phillies game. He goes, yeah, I have season tickets behind home plate to the Phillies. So I'm like thinking to myself, yeah, is this like my hush money right here? John started coming over a lot to the house, and eventually, according to Jason, he would be spending the entire night having sleepovers with his sister. The walls of the home didn't provide much soundproofing. I heard some psychologically disturbing noises in this house. <laughs> what, what do you mean by that? Psychologically disturbing noises. They came home late one night and, you know. John and your sister came home. John and my sister came home. She came in the front door, snuck him in the back door. I was studying for a psychology test and that's what I had to hear. In March, Jason responded by shooting this cell phone video of what he says is John leaving the house early one morning. Goslin would soon find more cameras pointed his way. Pulled up, got out, they both walked by me here. On the night of April 18th, a security guard at a hotel next to the Legends nightclub in Reading, Pennsylvania, recognized John when he and a young woman in her early 20s walked up a stairwell. The guard followed them. And he was standing right here with her, with his face up against her face. He then pulled his face away. Were they kissing? It, appeared to be kissing, yes. I mean, they were face to face. I said, sir, I said, you guys need help finding a room? And he said, no, I'm looking for the nightclub. So I said, well, that's downstairs, sir, out front. He goes, oh, okay, thanks. And she then smacked him, like, with her hand in the stomach and said, I told you, John. The guard encountered them again at 2 a.m. as they departed. He says to her at the time, babe, can you hand me my jacket? He called her babe. babe. John freaked out when he saw photographers lying in wait. He looked at me and said, get these effing paparazzi off your parking lot, sped off the parking lot. The photos of John with Deanna Hummel were an instant sensation. Fans wondered, were they having an affair? I've seen him out with plenty of friends, guys and girls, but that's just the kind of person he is. He, he's not going to give up his friendship, and if people want to believe that he's having an affair, he's not. When John left Legends with Deanna, he wasn't wearing his wedding ring. It was noticeably absent from his left finger. What father of eight goes out without his wedding ring? Things got worse one week later when Us Weekly released these photos of Deanna at John's home. A very telling picture while um, Kate was off doing a book tour, Deanna was photographed on the front lawn of the family house, sunbathing in a bikini as John relaxed in a deck chair. So when you open up the magazine, you see pictures of her lying in the yard, and he's there. I mean, how does that make you feel? I don't know how it makes me feel. I mean, my sister's a grown woman. She's going to do what she wants to do. You know, what am I supposed to say to that, you know? I don't really have any comment on that. John quickly released a statement. I may be guilty of choosing the wrong time and place to hang out with my friends, but I'm not guilty of cheating on my wife. If John's watching this, what would you want to tell him? Dude, if you're going to do it, be good about doing it. You know, be a little more sneaky, dude. Jason's brother has his own comment about John. Your wife is kind of crazy. I probably would cheat on her, too. Kate Goslin has always proven herself a resourceful partner. Back in 2007, when she and John were struggling to support eight young kids, Kate understood that starring in a reality TV show would bring in much needed cash. We estimate that they're on between fifty and $75,000 an episode. But on top of that, you've got all the freebies. You know, they have a deal with their local supermarket. They also get free clothes. There's lots of things that they get for free. From the start, Kate did her part to boost the family income. She wrote a couple books, and she was spending most weekends away traveling, doing speaking engagements. She really enjoyed the attention and the money that she was getting from it. She seems to kind of be like the glue, because she is very much about keeping things ordered and in control. She seems to be like the, the brains behind the whole operation. As the new television show gathered steam, Kate's look quickly underwent a total overhaul. She turned from housewife to TV star with every step captured on tape.
We've kind of gone from this dowdy looking mother into this glamazon. You know, she has uh, blonde hair now. She's had a tummy tuck. She's also had her teeth whitened. On top of this, she gets tanning twice a month. It's a very high maintenance look nowadays, which is completely different from the Kate that we were introduced to at first. But some of the locals felt Kate was turning into a diva. Normally in a neighborhood, people will wave to each other when they drive by. Every time I try to wave to her, she just looked the other way. This is a woman who people at Starbucks have told us she's rude to them. You know, she can't even order coffee without being rude to people. We've been told that when she goes and gets her hour-long manicure, that people aren't allowed to talk to her or look her in the face. You know, we hear these ridiculous stories of behavior that honestly would be better suited to a superstar, not a reality TV star. Would Why? you come here? Because. Very bossy and demanding. One shop that she was in, they all don't ever want to wait on her. And then when John comes in, they're like, oh, they're like, oh, he's such a great guy, you know, how is he so different than her? According to Us Weekly magazine, Kate is a demanding employer. One of the family's former nurses claims she went through 40 nannies in a three-month period. But others pick up a totally different vibe. I worked at the grocery store and she would come through my line and she didn't seem bossy or rude or anything. She just seemed like she really wanted things how she wanted them. By 2009, Kate Gosselin was truly a jet-setting celebrity. And what star doesn't want a bodyguard? Especially if he's a total hunk like this guy. Up next, is Kate getting touchy-feely with a silver fox? They've been described as love taps between Kate and Steve. Plus, will John and Kate's marriage survive through the show's new season? Kate and I obviously have been going through a lot of stuff and discussing what's best for our kids. We'll be right back.